Hello folks, this is Jeffrey G3 Tion here once again about to bring my 55th gameplay of the Pokemon Trading Card Game Online. I'm going to feature another new deck that I recently made from this new Ultra Prism set. It's my Dust Name Dust Main Necrozma deck. There are two forms of the uh, Necro now Dust Necrozma now. It's Dust Main Necrozma and Darwin's Necrozma. I'm gonna feature my Dust Dust Main Necrozma deck here today. I'm gonna show you how that deck works, and then you're gonna see it in the match. So I'm gonna play Lady Echo. So here's Dust Main Necrozma. 190 uh HP metal type, steel type basic Pokemon, Ultra Beast Pokemon. For three energy as Claw Slash, three color standard, it does 60. For three metal energy and a color that has medium tempest, it does 220, but you have to score three energy to it. And it has Sun's Eclipse GX attack as its GX attack, it does 250 damage. You only use it when you have less, more prizes than your opponent. It's a pretty good card, one of my fa my favorite cards from the set. So we're gonna power use it to we're gonna use it with uh Magnus Zone, which we print it. Here's the Magnezone, I'm gonna show the Magnezone right here. With this Magnezone, which has the Magnetic Circuit ability. It says, as often as you like going your turn before you attack, you may attach a Metal Energy card from your hand to one of your Pokemon. So, we basically use uh, his uh, Magnezone's ability to attach a lot of energy uh, to the Cosma, and then thus made the Cosma. And then we have an attack for 220 easily. It has, it has the Electric one too, which I'm gonna show here as well. It's the same, it's the same, pretty much the same one as the, uh, the Electric type. Just said that the Electra had the lightning one. Let's back and show it. It's right over here. As you can see. There it is right there. So it's the same, same, same base, same concept, just the metal type. Just the now the metal type, which makes it even better match. So here's the deck list. Here's the Pokemon. One Oranguru, we know that it has that instruct ability. Draw two you have three cards in, three, three cards in your hand, once per turn. Just in case if I uh, need some resources, I can get that with the Rangaroo. I also play one Diago GX, which is from the new set, this new set as well, Ultra Prism. For one Metal Energy, it's one eighty HP uh, stage, uh, basic Pokemon, Dragon type. For one Metal Energy, it's Overclock, you draw to you have six cards in your hand. Uh, for one Metal Energy, a Double Colors Energy, it has a shred at 80 damage. This attack doesn't, this attack damage is affected by any effects of your opponent's po active Pokemon. And then this GX is called T Timeless GX, it does 150 for five energy. You just pretty much skip your opponent's next turn, so you could pretty much take another turn. I like to use this GX to attack better, but some of the GX attack is fine. But I like to get this one off if like if I can knock out anything like if I can take quick prizes this turn. So I like out like a top of the with a choice but that's 180. And I can have something else that's 180 too, which is great. Okay, then I play um three the three dust main of Cosmo GX, which I pretty much explained before. 313 the Magnet uh Magnemite uh the Magnus Magnus Online. This Magnemite is also new from the new set. It has a solid unit ability. As long as you have this Pokemon as your bench, prevent all damage done to your Pokemon by attacks, both dealers and opponents. So so Coco can't spread away, can't be attacked by Buzzwall on the bench. I like this one better than the Elect the Lightning type because Buzzwall pretty much destroys it because he's weak to fighting. But it has, it has the magnet uh the retreat uh it gives a free retreat, but I like this one better. It has a Magneton. For one energy ram, metal energy ram does 20. For two metal and a psych, uh, no, colors, side of cannon for 80. For cannon, side of cannon for this turn. So, just really came my cannon, I can slowly evolve to the Magnus Zone line easily. I also play one Lele for the one attack ability to get that supporter if I need that first turn Bridget or that supporter if I need just in case I don't draw one. That's it for the Pokemon. Now we're gonna draw the trainers. Field Blower, two, I play two Field Blower. Pretty much uh, says I'll uh, choose to uh, get rid of some stadiums or, or some uh, tools like under the Goblet Tox and the Goblet Door, which are gates abilities, so I need that's very important to use. I pick one Professor's Letter. I pick my deck for two basic energy and put them in my hand, so fast way to get energy out from my uh, Magnus Zone's ability, and then I can use it for Duxman's attack. Then I play three Red Candy, so I can skip from uh, Magnemite to Magnus Zone without going to the Magnus Zone, so I get Magnus Zone faster. I play one Super Rod to get back those energies or basic Pokemon as well, so just in case I run out of some as well. Then I play four Ultra Ball, pretty much a staple. Just got two cards from your hand. If you do search your deck for my Pokemon and build it, put it to your hand. Search for anything in the deck. I play one Ultra the Sun, which says Fire and Metal Pokemon don't have any weakness. So just in case I play against the Volcania matchup, this will become a handy. Because uh, Volcania is the worst matchup against the deck because they are weak to fire. So I play that pretty much for that re reason. And I play three Mile Corner, which is also a new stadium for the new set. Once during each player's turn, I play, may put two metal energies from the hand, discard prior to the hand. So pretty much I use that st stadium to get back metal energies for, for Magnetic Circuit. I can really attach it to Dust Magnet Cosma or Diago GX. I play one Bridget, get those uh, Magnet Magnet Might, and Dust Magnet Cosma is out fast enough so I can get that turn two, hopefully, right handy into a Magnet Zone and then go off with the Magnetic Circuit. 
to Cynthia draws the new card. One of my favorite supporter now. This is so far. Support Sylvia Hendricks to six. This is pretty good. Staple supporter. To Guzma, it's pretty much a switch, so I can knock on easy targets, or if I can get that last target for the game. Then play one Lily, draw to have six, but if you have it on your first turn, you can draw to have eight. So I like this supporter a lot. You gotta put them with the new art on this side, as you can tell, I can see, as you can see. I can show the art on it too as well. It has the old art right over here. So let's go back. Then we play, and then I play, I think, two N, I think. Let me get rid of that. Next one, yeah, I do play two N. So pretty much, uh, is that I use that late game if I if I'm losing a ton of prizes, I I end my opponent down to a few cards so they can't do anything else. One for Kakuri, so I get that 20 damage output, pretty much, which is pretty important. Gets hit its numbers, I can draw two cards as well. For first and second one, no exclamation there, just draw sky, draw seven, best draw support in the game besides Cynthia. One Skylar, so I can get that red candy or any field blowers I need. Any trader card I can get, I can put it to my hand. She says if I if I get stuck, I go with the doctor other door. I play three choice spans so I can hit numbers with the 250. I can like, pretty much knock out Meta Girls with the Citra Wild or anything with 230 as well. So it's good for numbers too. Then I play, I think, two Float Stones to get if I get that um, Orangaroo or the Sogo Lair. Oh, I further mention Sogo Lair or Prism Stone, which I do play as well. I'm going to put that right here as well. Then I play uh, 12 Metal Energy. Here's the Sogo Lair Prism Stone with the new Prism Mechanic, which came out from the set. Pretty much it says you're going to have one of the cards in that deck. For one energy, metal energy radiant store, for each of the opponents Pokemon play, you attach a metal energy for the card from the discard pile for your Pokemon in any way you like. And for four energy, Corona impact for 160, you can't use it, can't attack during the next turn. So pretty much I use it for mainly for his first attack. So if I, if I get stuck, I can just get the score a lot of metal energy and then I can um, get reload a Dark Metal Cause Man stuff. So, okay, so that's pretty much the deck. Hope you guys enjoyed the explanation. Let's get to the game. Let's see if I can hopefully get a win with this deck here today. Let's find Dustman of Krozma. He's right over here. It's my this is my favorite deck I wanted to play ever since the set came out. So hopefully I can get the other one with this deck right here. I like it. It's good numbers as well. So I'll be playing against Reg Lee. Looks like playing in five seconds. So I'll be playing against Buzz War Garbage though, maybe. Let's see, I get the coin flick. Like call heads. We do lose a fortune, so he lets, he'll get to decide who gets to go first. It most likely will be him. Yep, so let's see our opening hand. Okay. Oh, I got two Magnum. Okay, this is a fair hand. I got two Magnemite at least. But I'd love to get a dust. I'd love to get a dust main of Crow's Man out there, or a Bridger as well, or Ultra Ball. So he's ball again, which is good. So let's see what I get. he gets. He took one Mulligan. So let's, and then we get to draw one extra card for a Mulligan, and then we we'll draw next up on the turn. Let's see. Let's just this is active, he only has one active, it's probably gonna be a buzz wall. So I'll draw that auction card. I was a dust man, which is great, which is exactly what I wanted. And I'm going to pass, that's it. So he's gonna start with buzz wall, of course. Let's see what he does. Parallel City. Okay, so pretty much I'm gonna have up to three Pokemon on my bench. And he's gonna play a first turn later, drawing two, he has eight, drawing three cards because he draws the other eight. So he draws another buzz wall, plays a max elixir, misses the max elixir, and attaches a strong enemy to the buzz wall. Because it's 20 more damage output, and he's gonna pass. My turn now. I draw a Guzma. So I'm going to full stone on the active. I'm going to detach your metal energy to dust main. I'm going to retreat, set out the dust main, and I'm going to play N. If I get a red candy magnus over with a bunch of energy. Okay, I get the magnus zones, but I don't get the red candies. Alright, so I'm gonna end my turn there. I'm not gonna do play anything else right now. I'd love to get a red candy next. Or oh, Skylar as well. Let's see what my opponent does. He plays a fighting furry ball, giving balls well 40 more HP and 10 more damage. I'll put he's gonna ultra ball. It's gonna two fighting energy to get. Probably a Lele. Yes, a Lele. Top of Lele. Let's see what support he's gonna touch out. He's gonna search out Cynthia, okay? So he's gonna shuffle his hand and draw six. Let's get a red candy here this turn, hopefully, so I can go for that first turn, get that Magna uh, Magna Zone out there. So drops another a Cobb Ink. Plays another Max Elixir. And this one misses again. So he touches all the fine energy to the Swaz. So he's gonna do 60 to Dust Main. And it can't hit the bench because thanks to uh thanks to um Um Dust Main uh Magnus on uh, Magnemite's ability. So I'm playing the Mount Coronet. Then I have the second one here, so I can get the hopefully I will lose two Magnum. I do play Super Rod, two Magnus on. That's what I got. Okay, no red candy. I got another Magnum and a Okay, 
Okay, so I'm going to I'm gonna ultra ball for the magneton. Discarding uh this and the choice band. I'm gonna the choice band to get a um uh, uh my magneton is pressed. I'm not gonna grab anything as a matter of fact. I'm gonna instruct for one. I got an ultra ball. Okay, I'm gonna hold on to that ultra ball and I'm gonna pass. He might take a knock on my on my um on my uh dust man this turn. So you're gonna play the fire engine five minutes not five minutes of the buzz on the bench. Let's see what he does next. He's gonna touch the energy, yep. He has to set it. This is part of the obstruction GX. He does 40 times now prizes he's taken, so on, on his bet and so. So you can set up for a knock up and like, knock on my other dust man. Okay, so let's let's put um, let's put the magnum with the force. So I'm gonna play the Sogaleo. I'm going to attach a metal to the dust main. I'm gonna instruct for one, see what I get. I got a magnum, so I'm gonna end that's for sure. Let's figure out a red cannon in the magnum zone. Oh, I, I can get the magnum zone. I can I, oh, but I can knock a buzz buzz wall this turn. I'm gonna ultra with the the uh, ultra the sun and the Guzma to grab the magnum zone. So I'm going to evoke my cannon to the Magna Zone. Why can't I not use the Sun to clip GX? So I'm going to Mount Corner and get back to energy. And I'm going to play the Magnetic Circuit ability attached to the Dust Man on my bench. Attach three energy for now. I'll hold on the fourth. I'll retreat and send up Dust Main. And I'll use Sun to clip GX for knockout. For 250. Let's see what two prizes I get. That's great. So now there's no energy on the board, so I'm pretty much safe so far. I got a float store and a skylock. Okay. Okay, so let's see what we're gonna get. We'll Stops his proposal to cut bink. Attach it to uh as well as another cut bink. Gets a max of so and misses it again. There's another fighting for on the cut bink. Drops a lele. It's probably for a second one. Yep, that is right. I wish I had a Guzma in my hand now. I already used one. Hope I, can, hope I can draw him to my other. Let's see what he does. He's playing parallel, so I'll get rid of a Ranguru and one of my Magnemites. For now. Just fine, because I can just. So I'm going to say he's going to send out Trubbish. Trubbish, Trubbish to the bench. Attach a Flowstone to it. Got to be careful with that card because he can. He can uh, go with Tasha, can hurt me here. He passes. I draw a Lele, so I'm going to attach your energy to the Dust Main. I'm going to scatter for another more Coronet so I can bench more next. Actually, no. I'll play a Cynthia. I'm going to attach your Floater to the other Magna Zone. I'm going to set down. I don't need to play anything else right now. I, think I got a set. I feel set up already. I'm going to just attack with Many the Tempest. Knock him out, just my three energy. Let's see what prize I get this time. And get another manager. Okay, this is good. So he's gonna set his other card bink. It's pretty good, I can just keep recycling energy back. Oh, that's the Goblet Attackson, so that's gonna hurt me a little bit. I, I guess I have the Skylar, so I can Skylar for the Field Blower. Okay, he plays the end. Okay, so let's go, there goes Skylar. Let's see what I draw. I do a Guzma, which is good. But I can't knock out this, uh... I can use probably Sol I can use Sol Galeo if anything. Which I'm probably gonna do. He goes to the break. Plays the Max Elixir. It's at this time. He's gonna dominate it for 20. For 40. And probably gonna attach two more energy to the boss one in the active spot. Okay, so let's see. I need to top like a field blow at Skylar. Drew back hand, it's not useful right now. Alright, so I'm going to... Let me see what can I do here. I'm going to Guzma. I'm going to bring out... The Buzzwall. I'll bring my Sogalera Prism. I'm going to attach to the Sogalera. I'm going to use Pris uh, Radiant Star so I can attach... Four energies to... I'll attach... Three to Dustman, I'll attach one to um, Magnazor just in case. So I will have, um, I will have, um, Dust Man ready for attack for the next turn. Drops another buzz wall down. He's gonna knock me out with knocker, which is fine. 
I can't, I didn't have a choice but to knock this thing out. Oh, Kukui. I'm sorry. My summoner gets removed because he goes, this is in the, uh, the prison, uh, lost. So I'm gonna drop the other dust main. Okay, but I can weaken it for 230, 220 at least, which I'm gonna do right now. That's how I feel like I can just knock it out. Okay. Oh, that's how I feel like I can knock, I will knock this thing out. Let's see what he draws. We're not gonna buy we're not. It's gonna retreat actually. Set on card bank again. Catch us to the back to the bench. He's gonna play Cynthia drawing six. Okay, so you're gonna play for another 40. Probably get buzz more ready. This buzz more ready this time. Okay, yep. This is expected. Let's see what I draw. Draw the manager, which is completely dead. I'm gonna attach to the act uh, the bench. Best man, and I'm gonna pass. So this one's gonna go down. I need to talk to my worst right now. Try to another stroke the Cub Inc. It's gonna get him for another 40. For 60 this time, okay. Let's gonna get this buzz wall ready. Let's see what I draw this time. Come on, give me a supporter, please. Another Mark which is completely dead to me. So I'll get two more metal energy from the pile. I'm gonna attach to the this one right here, and I'm gonna pass. He's gonna ultra ball the scarding. Probably ultra ball for nothing, because his bench is discarded both nest balls. For another garbage though, okay. Probably gonna discard it. I was gonna Cynthia, okay, draw it six. So this card this card is gonna go down. Tatters a fourth strong, so you can knock out Buzz War in one shot. I apologize for knockout. I'll send on the Magnus with the favorite tree. I think he's got this the other way though, because he can just knock me out with this one. Well, not unless I draw a field blower and then I go off. Let's see. Okay, so I just, well, let's pull the Magnus zone. See what I draw. A super which is not gonna help me here. I guess I missed it. What super stuff I want to super run back? Magnus zone, a Manguru, and another dust main. I just got this other way, folks. I can't really do nothing. Who do the tree and just knock out anything at this point? So the only thing I can really do is call uh, claw slash for sixty. That sucks. I need to be able to fear blow that game. I think that would have been fine. I was gonna goose my bring out the Magnum, right? The Magnum Zone. And knock this thing out. Alright, then. There you go, folks. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully, we're gonna win today. But stay tuned for more videos. And I will see you next time. Bye for now.